My name is Jamila and I am coming to you from Accra, Ghana, right near the Independence Square and also the Freedom and Justice Arch. As you can see, I rep Ghana. Anyway, I'm not here to talk about Ghana's independence. What I am here to talk about is another important event. That's our election coming up in December 2012, mere months from now. A lot of people believe it's going to be decisive and we at Ghana Decides would like to know what you think about it. Do you think Ghana should be focusing on health or education? Who would be your main presidential candidate and why? If you were president, what would be your main priority? These are some of the questions that we would like to invite you to answer. Now, how does this work? You know the game tag, you're it? Well, we're taking it to a social media level. What you're going to do is you're going to upload videos of yourself answering questions that Ghana Decides has prepared on the election. And after you answer the questions, guess what? You get to pick your friends who can answer the same questions as well. And it keeps going on and on and on and on. So, what are you waiting for? You're it. My name is Jamila Abdullahi and my vision for a new Ghana is a place where originality is encouraged, differences are celebrated and poverty is a thing of the past. It's a place where passionate Ghanaians like you and I work together to bring Ghana to her full potential. If I were president, I would encourage citizens to ask questions and make me and my government accountable. I registered to vote in my rural hometown and I left Accra early in the morning and got there around 7 a.m. This is the first time I'll be voting in my, um, in my life. Uh, the other times I was out of the country at the time that the voting was happening. So I'm pretty excited to exercise my franchise and participate in um, you know, shaping who uh, leads the country on the political level. I think Ghanaian citizens living abroad should be able to vote via absentee ballot because although they are physically absent, many are contributing to the country's development by sending funds back home and they deserve a say in deciding which political party is responsible for the direction of that development. My vote will go to the party that puts in place programs to build the skill set of the youth, making them ready to run their own businesses and contribute meaningfully to various aspects of development 10, 20 years down the line. important issue for me during the elections is development and the economy. Um, I think Ghana needs to have a stronger development plan. Um, I think we need to focus a bit more on making sure that there's wealth in the country and that this wealth just doesn't stay with the middle classes but actually trickles down to the poor.